on the horror was coming to the theaters, and it was about um, women in Afghanistan. <coughs> this is the result of that film. My eyes followed me after viewing the film Kandahar. My eyes followed them, women in burkas of gold, cream blue burgundy, women unseen traveling to a wedding party to somewhere in Kandahar. How do I know they are women except that only women wear burkas, covered from head to foot with squares of opening, netted or crocheted, framing their eyes, and even in their embroidered beauty and intricate stitching of covers over their heads, do not distract. My eyes follow them. Children in cotton, in colors of birds, their eyes fixed on the unseen viewer. Their eyes follow the camera, aimed at their forehead, throats. The girls are not covered up like their grandmothers, mothers, aunts, until one day as they approach womanhood, then too they will wear burqas, then too they will remain invisible. And still my eyes follow them. A woman hands a lipstick to her sister, who runs a slash of very red across her unseen lips. Because in their burqas, to these watching eyes, beauty blossoms, beauty blossoms in secret salons and homes where women carry out rituals who teach girl children to read Arabic who resist the law handed down by men demanding invisibility as their right. 